Welcome to Christiana Flourishing, where we motivate you with God Word. Welcome to my channel. The great footballer Pele died a few days ago, and this is what Reverend Dr. Chris Oyakilome and our great man of God, Prophet Huber Angel, said that nobody knows about him. Please watch this video and remember to subscribe, like, and share. It was said that uh, the great footballer Pele, many of you know him. Even though you have not seen him before you were born, your father talked about him. Now, he, how many of you have heard of Pele? Okay. One of the world's greatest footballers, if not acclaimed the greatest. But he said when he was 10 years old, Brazil lost at the World Cup. They lost to Uruguay. And his father was crying. He was 10 years old. So he came to, the, Daddy, why are you crying? Daddy said, Brazil lost the match. That means there's going to be no party. Because the whole country would have been a party in. But Brazil lost. And daddy was crying, like many daddies. I hope they are not here. <laughs> okay. No, they will come. Then we will change them. Is that okay? A whole daddy crying that, that, that the country lost. Some even died. You know that. Okay. Anyway. Ten-year-old Pelé said to his father, why are you crying? He said, because Brazil lost. Oh, the little boy said, daddy, don't cry. Daddy, don't cry. He said, I will win the World Cup for you. I think it was about seven years later, when he was 17 years old, he played at the World Cup. And Brazil won. And he scored. He made it. He helped Brazil win the cup. And he said he remembered his father because he won the World Cup for his father. And not touching. Ten year old boy said, I will win the World Cup for you. I don't know what cup you want to win for Jesus. Then the Lord said to me something that I need to say it nicely. This one, this year, I saw them crying for a legend in Brazil. Everyone. And the Lord said, look, they are crying for a person. But they're not crying for their ways. You know when you have a sports legend in a city, in a country, and everyone is just glued to the TV and say, is he dead? Is he gone? Are they telling us the truth? Is he really dead? Pele will die. Dying is going to die. So that you can prove God speaks. No, you can prove I hear from God. You know this. This whole thing is about trying to prove that the God we serve knows everything. And if he knows the simple things about your life, like football, he will definitely know about you. We know, of course, Pele is going to die. 